Hi, today I am going to show you how to use a Raspberry Pi to stream your laptop or PC's display. You might have bought a HDMI capture card, but you don't have another PC to connect it to. But now you can connect the HDMI capture card to your Raspberry Pi and use your Pi to stream or record the video. To do this, you are going to need a Raspberry Pi, a SD card attached with Raspberry Pi OS, a HDMI capture card, and a HDMI cable. First, we are going to connect the HDMI capture card to a HDMI cable and connect the other end of the HDMI cable to a PC or laptop. Then, connect the USB end of the capture card to the Raspberry Pi. Then, we are going to install OBS Studio on a Raspberry Pi so that we can record or stream the video coming from a HDMI capture card. It's pretty simple, right? So now that you know how it's going to work, let's see how to install OBS on a Raspberry Pi. OBS is the go-to software for recording or streaming your PC screen. It's very simple to install on your Raspberry Pi. Just open the terminal using the keyboard shortcut Ctrl Alt T. Or you can open it from the Applications menu from under the Accessories section. Once you have the terminal open, paste this one command which you will find in the description below and just click Enter. What this command does is it installs Pi Apps in an app store for the Raspberry Pi and then uses it to install OBS Studio. Let it finish installing. As you can see, OBS has finished installing. Now that we have finished installing OBS, let's set up the capture card. Setting up the capture card is very simple. Connect one end of the HDMI cable to your laptop or PC's HDMI port and connect the other end of the HDMI cable to the HDMI capture card. And then connect the USB end of the HDMI capture card to your Raspberry Pi. Pretty simple, right? Now that we have finished setting up the HDMI capture card, let's set up OBS Studio on our Raspberry Pi. I'm using my capture card to connect my laptop to the Pi. I won't be able to use it to record my Raspberry Pi. So I'm using VLC Viewer to record the screen of my Pi. First, we need to launch OBS Studio. We can launch it by clicking on the application icon here, then clicking on sound and video, and then clicking on OBS Studio. You might have to finish the initial setup first. So let me maximize it. Then click on the plus here. Then click on video capture device. Name it anything you want. I'm going to name it capture card. Then click on OK. And make sure that is USB video. And then click on OK. You might be wondering why you're unable to see the screen of your laptop or PC. That's because you're not duplicating the screen over the HDMI port. To do that on Windows, you can use the keyboard shortcut Windows P which will open this window here and from here you can choose the duplicate option. In Linux you can use X render and you can use this command here. Make sure to replace EDP and HDMI A0 with your displaced names. But right now I am going to use a Rofi script. I'm going to choose clone screen. So EDP is my laptop screen and HDMI A0 is my capture card. So let me just click that. And if I see here, you can see that I'm able to see my laptop screen. You might say that this is a Raspberry Pi screen, but this is showing me this because I'm seeing the Raspberry Pi screen on my laptop. So let me just refresh the window. So if I minimize the VMC window, you can see it's actually showing the laptop screen here. You can see the bar on top. And you can even see the bar in the OBS preview window. And as you can see, the Raspberry Pi is capturing my laptop screen. So that's it, we are done. Now you can use the Raspberry Pi to record the screen or stream it to YouTube or Twitch or do anything you want. Thanks for watching and don't forget to check out my other videos.